On Friday, November 21st, the Most Reverend Richard Lennon, Bishop of Cleveland, began the year of consecrated life with an opening Mass in the Cathedral of St. John the Evangelist. During his homily, Bishop Lennon reflected on the Second Vatican Council's teaching on religious life, as well as the Church's universal call to holiness. Bishop also spoke about the gift that religious life has been to the Church. Women and men living in consecrated life have taught in schools, cared for the poor and the needy, brought hope and comfort to those in hospitals, all of which attests to the abundance of God's love for his church and for all people as he has shared the gift of consecrated life for the good of humanity. What a wonderful way to begin this year. So many religious joining together here this evening and to be ready for the year that comes that we can reflect upon the gifts that God has given us, express our gratitude, and help people realize that in God's providence, he provides well for us. May we share that and express our gratitude to those who have lived consecrated life in such an exemplary manner. Thank you, all of you, for what you have done, but more importantly, for who you are. The Holy Father is asking the church's religious sisters, brothers, and priests to wake up the world with their testimony of faith, holiness, and hope. The Diocese of Cleveland has set up a special website, www.churchvocations.com, to highlight the contributions of religious vocations in the diocese. Other resources being released in 2015 include a special video, parish presentations, and a pilgrimage to various congregational homes and ministry centers planned for the summer. The celebration will conclude February 2nd, 2016 with the World Day of Prayer for Consecrated Life. For more information about the Diocese of Cleveland celebration for the Year of Consecrated Life, please visit www.churchvocations.com.